The last time the briar was held in London, Ontario was about a half century ago and people around here still remember it. It was the year that Hector Gervais, the St. Albert potato farmer, the friendly giant, won the briar. And I'll tell you what, if Kevin Martin wins this year, it'll be remembered just as <laughs> fondly and for as long, maybe longer, because he will become the first skip ever in the history of the Briar to win five times. You've got Ernie Richardson who won four, of course you've got Randy Furby who won six as a, uh, two of them were not a skip and none of them were holding or throwing the last rock. So. Kevin Martin would be all by himself with an addition of a gold medal at the Olympics and another silver medal at the Olympics as the ultimate curler of all time. That's how much history is on the line, but there's even more as the uh, Briar opens in London, Ontario. The deal is that his rink, although they did not compete last year because they were otherwise occupied with, you know, the Olympics, has a 26-game winning streak to take into the event. Uh, they've won two in a row in, in the, the previous two with the one, of course, that, uh, that Kevin Cooey subbed and won for Edmonton and Alberta. The Albertans have won, this would be his third with this current rink, and that would uh, match, uh, you know, the, the, so many other rinks in history. Uh, so the players on the rink are more concerned just about what they're doing right now. And it's probably the best field that you could imagine will be put together for the Briar because you couldn't pick a better team from each province across uh, to represent the province that is going to be there this year. So it's going to be a test to do it. But I'm betting that Kevin Martin will do it and will win his fifth Briar in London, Ontario. I'm Terry Jones at large.